Chris Hemsworth is transformed again. After the incident with Thanos, Thor lost his way feeling disappointed in disarray. Here's how Thor finds his way back. What makes this case special is that Endgame depicted Thor in his most vulnerable state yet. After succumbing to despair after struggling to save Thanos from snapping in Avengers Infinity War, the God of Thunder spent the next five years letting himself go. He had gained a considerable amount of weight and was still reeling from their defeat to the Mad Titan when he was hired for the time heist. It's uncertain how much time has passed between the events of Endgame and Thor Love and Thunder, but the hero was already at the heavy side of the last time he appeared in the MCU. He did magically shed the weight he acquired during his toughest moment, despite having a more cheerful mood due to a pep talk with his mother and the eventual loss of Thanos. Now as with Hemsworth, the hero will most likely be in the best shape of his life when he returns to the franchise. Thor's new look in the forthcoming MCU film may be a sign of his mental state, as his physicality in Endgame was directly linked to his despair and desperation. However, there is nothing wrong with being bloated. Overweight Thor was not Thor in his most normal and happy state. Doing anything he truly enjoys, such as discovering the cosmos with the Guardians of the Galaxy, may have helped him overcome the PTSD he suffered, the consequences of Thanos wiping out half of the human race in front of him in Infinity War. Star-Lord and Rocket Raccoon in particular may have supported him in this direction as all celestial heroes have experienced immense trauma in their personal lives and have stayed strong through it.